What's goody, what's goody, what's goody, people? It's your boy JFK right here, Steak Sauce Television. We live and direct, man. There's been a lot of crazy ish going on, man. I don't even know where to start, man, but I think I'm going to start with the Super Bowl performance, which we already know the Super Bowl was like super rigged, which I feel like most. NFL, NBA, I feel like all of that's rigged. Like, I feel it's been rigged for years. I feel like, like, the more older you get, the more you're supposed to realize that. Like, I could see getting you as a kid, but if you grown and you think the NBA is not rigged or the NFL is not rigged, bro, you need to, <laughs> like, open the third eye up or something. But, Swish Beats. I know for a fact you got to be like a little mad. Me, I'd probably be a lot mad. But I seen you put up some talking about, oh, we worried about the wrong thing. Like shorty dress covered the whole stage or whatever, whatever. I didn't even watch it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I don't even know. But all I know is. I seen that clip, the way Usher was up on Alicia Keys. And what got me was her smile. That smile. Is, man, that smile was different. <laughs> Yo, that smile was different, homie. I don't know. Like, maybe Usher might have got that before you even, before Swish even got with her because... Her smile was it. It'd it be like the Joker almost. <laughs> like, word, bro. She almost had that Joker smile going on. You know what I'm saying? So, it almost looked like Ush probably done had that in the past. Like, Usher probably done got that in the past. You know what I mean? Ain't like, <laughs> he definitely got that in the past, though. But the Super Bowl definitely looks super rigged. You got Taylor Swift. Like, Taylor Swift got more power than the president right now. So, whatever whatever she say, y'all supposed to bet. Like, all y'all betters and all of that. Like, there's no way you supposed to bet against Taylor. You know what I'm saying? Like, she almost run the world. Like, she got literally almost more power than the president, bro. Like, <laughs> real talk. You know what I mean? So, it's like... You have to, like, you know what I mean? And what's up with all these grown men on YouTube beefing, yo? Yo, a lot of y'all, man, I, I'm going to keep it 100. Like, a lot of y'all, y'all was informational. Like, y'all used to be dropping knowledge. I ain't going to call out no names or nothing like that because I ain't on that type of time. But y'all mad grown, bro. And y'all be trying, and a lot of y'all be trying to be like, 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 trying to talk to the youth or whatever. How you trying to talk to the youth, but you online beefing? And your videos is all beef now. It's no, no dropping jewels, no nothing. Just you talking about another man at that, that, like. I really think that's crazy, yo. Like, y'all be like 50 plus yelling at y'all phone. Like, that is crazy to me. Word. Word. Know what I mean? Then we got... Who else? Who else we got? Oh, yeah, Monique went on Shannon Sharp show. I probably could... I don't even like that saying Shay Shay for a man. Like, that's kind of weird, but I didn't watch that one. Like, the only Shannon Sharp episode I ever watched was the one with him and Mike Epps. No, oops, Mike Epps. <laughs> oh, yeah, they is beefing, too. That's crazy. We going to get to that, too. But the only uh, Shannon Sharp, like, full episode I watched was probably the one with Cat Williams. That's the only... The only, like, full Shannon Sharp interview I ever watched. And I only watched that because it was Cat Williams. Like, Cat Williams don't even do interviews like that. So, it was like, you know what I'm saying? So, I, I definitely watched that. But, I see Monique's son. Her oldest son came out. And I didn't even know, like, 
that she wasn't like there for her son like that's crazy but i guess she's already came out and said that she apologized and this you know what's crazy too like that <coughs> <coughs> I seen a lot of people telling that dude to grow up, like, because he came out with it. Her oldest son came out with a video, I think, like, today. And, um, he basically was, you know, saying Monique, like, full of, full of, you know what I mean? Like, she fronting, but she basically left him to become a star. And, you know, that's kind of like almost a ritual, almost, if you think about it. Like, you have to cut off your loved ones. Like, you know, a son with the mother, like, that mother's son love. Like, that's why when I heard that, I'm like, wow, that's crazy because I love my mother. Like, you know what I mean? Like, the that son-mother love is it's different. You know what I'm saying? So I kind of feel sorry for him. And, like, I was seeing people comment, like, saying, oh, he need to grow up. And, you know, it's crazy when... When the mom shit on the son, like, but if if he was talking about his dad, it would have kind of been a little more, you know what I'm saying? Man, when you missing a parent, like, some people, we all deal with stuff different. Like, I used to be on that type of time, too. I would have been like, because I didn't have my father in my life at all, you know what I'm saying? But I know him, but I didn't, he wasn't around like that, you know what I mean? At all, so... I know the feeling, so it's like, you know what I mean? I have people who usually be talking crazy, they just, some of them be real, like, hard going, like, tough, like, and I ain't about to say no pause or nothing like that, because you know the subject we on, so, you know what I'm saying? We talk about a son and a mother relationship, we ain't talk about nothing anyway, that's weirdo stuff, anyway, though. So it's like, people have different bringing, bringing up, and they came up differently, so it's like, you know what I'm saying? You People deal with everything differently. You know what I mean? So, I feel like it's not like he... It, it, the video wasn't like he was looking to reconcile anything with her or try to... You know, it's like he gave up on that. He probably was... It seemed like he was just trying to really, like, just speak on what she was saying about him on the Shannon Sharp show. And a lot of people was down in them, you know what I mean? Or grow up, this, that, and the third. Whatever. I mean, me personally, I feel like shit. You can't, you really can't be, you really can't get over a parent not being there. You know what I'm saying? Like, some of us can't. And that's just what it is, you know what I'm saying? Then you got Shannon Sharp beefing with Mike Epps. Another episode of two grown ASS men beefing. Like, yo, what's up with that? <laughs> like, you know, and, and why it's never like, it's always the color, black people. It's always us. You don't see that with the white people, like white comedians. You don't see them beefing with each other. But you, you don't see other white rappers beefing with each other. It's just, you don't see white actors beefing with each other but you just you see will smith slapping chris rock but you don't see will ferrell slapping uh jerry seinfeld or something you know what i'm saying like it's all weird to me you know what i'm saying that industry stuff that's all weird and another thing and i know youtube don't be on like when we talk about what i'm about to talk about but i just want to know like who really went to the polls and voted for Joe Biden. <laughs> like, like who really, like, y'all really, like, who's voting for this dude? Like, that's crazy to me. But we gonna skip back, because I told y'all this steak sauce television, and we all over the place. But we gonna jump back to the Shannon Sharp and Mike Epps, because why is these dudes beefing? It's all publicity, though. I want y'all to know that, like, all of these people work together, man. Their job is to entertain us. You know what I'm saying? Shannon Sharp was a was a was in the NFL. You know what I mean? And he looked a little too zesty too, man. Like he too, yo, it's it's 
He look like this person that be on IG, man. I can't even think, yo. <laughs> but yo, man. Another thing I want to say before I sign out on this episode of Steak Sauce Television. When we all going to come together? Like, squash the race car, squash whatever. Just all of us just come together and get whatever we want. You know what I'm saying? Do y'all know we, the people, have the most power? Like, we are the government. Like, y'all voting for people and... Y'all is the, like, we, you got people in New York, they got dirty water, them people in Flint water, they, they probably, they water probably still messed up, but Joe Biden sending billions to Ukraine, yo, all that money he done sent to Ukraine right now could have probably ended homelessness right here in the United States, all those billions, clean water for everybody. And if you funding a war, why you ain't sending them weapons? Why you got to send them money? Y'all ever thought of that? Like, this world we living in, man, it's crazy, yo. We get raped all the way around the board. You got to pay taxes. Like, the IRS don't help you find a job. Why I have to pay them? And then if I don't, I go to jail. Like, I don't even know where my money's going. Like, what? Are you serious? And we don't even riot and protest about that. And I'm not saying do that. I'm just saying, like, you know what I mean? Like, it's just weird to me. We are, why we don't just come together? My people, we just killing each other. I don't know why for nothing. Y'all steady feeding y'all minds with power and all of this stuff that's Yo, it's crazy because y'all are probably like, he tripping. But when you watch that type of stuff, it triggers something in your brain. That's why you'll be like, well, I kind of want to go hustle. That's why you got all these dudes out here hustling that don't even know what they doing. You know what I mean? You can just ride down the street and see people at cars with their hand like this. Like, that looks so obvious. If I ride by and you at the car with your hand like this, I already know what's going on. But this your boy, man. Half a stack. Big Jack, all that. JFK, man. Steak Sauce Television signing out. Ow.